Hi all in this lesson we are going to learn how to create our first GUI application using PWCT 1.9 Art. At first we will create new project file click file then newer click the new button from the toolbar. When we click the new file button we will see a new window to select a template for our project file. We are going to create GUI application so we will select the GUI application without coding template. Now, double click to use it. We will create a new folder for our project. The folder name will be test and the project file name will be test.ssf. Our new project file contains only one step called the first step. To add or generate new steps click the interact button. Now we are using the components browser window. Our visual programming language contains group of domains and each domain may contains one or more of components that we can use. To add new window to our application select the windows domain. Then select the Define New Window component. Now we are using the interaction using Transporter window of the Define New Window component. Determine the window title for example type Hello World. Now click the OK button to continue. Look at the steps tree we have new 6 steps. Define new window when one title Hello World. Window Events. Window Properties. Window Controls. End of Window. And Activate Window. Now to run the application, press Ctrl plus R or click on this button in the toolbar. Congratulations, this is our application during the run time. Now we will go to the application folder to look at our project files. Test.x is our executable file which can be distributed and executed in any Windows machine without the need to install PWCT. Test.fpt and test.ssf are our visual source files. Test.prg are the generated source code file in the Harbor programming language. Contemp.bat is used to generate the executable file from the generated source code file and this process requires PWCT. To modify the window title, select the Define New Window step then double click. Type Hello World from PWCT then click the OK button. We see that the step name is changed to reflect the new window title. Thanks for listening. Goodbye.